I'm Daniel Tietz, Daniel Tietz from Germany and I just arrived in Sydney. Yesterday I arrived here at the Occupy Sydney movement and I was welcomed from the first minute. What these people do here is awesome. <laughs> This, this, this community is very peaceful, greets all the people walking by. They share information with people who want information, they ask the question, but always stay friendly. They do not force people to listen to them. There are books for free, they have the free library here, and also they run uh, a free schooling program where they educate people for free about uh, energy and the financial system. I think the Occupy movement uh, as a global movement is a big indicator of change that is happening. And as important as it is that these structural changes are happening, that these people here are talking about, it is as well important for humanity or for the new society that we all want to see in our world. To change the world, we are interacting and behaving with each other. And I see these people here so friendly and accepting to a stranger like me. They, they are talking to each other, they are sharing information and ideas. I, I saw people who definitely do not, not talk to others about their ideas easily, sharing their ideas. I see, I see them smiling at strangers, I see them playing music here. And I think this is one of the major aspects of the change for the world we want to live in. The change of interacting with each other the change of interacting with ourselves with it. because the structures that are a part of this world, the structures that the ruling structure and the need to control to need to be understood to be changed. Otherwise we just replace it with another with another system that controls and we, we lose this big opportunity, but I don't think that's going to happen because the time is ready. We have the internet, we have the global movement. For a long time, we see book, book cupboards in the bookshop shops with body, mind and spirit books, with spiritual books, we see alternative healing methods in every city. We see the people getting interested in, in, in peace and in love and so, but that's where they want to make this massive control. And I think that's where it is time for the people so, to re reflect on themselves. Okay. And I see the people doing this. And that's what I want to do. That's why I'm speaking at the preschool about ourselves. All these camp trails that we watched in the I'm very happy to be part of this and I thank Occupy Sydney as well as the whole world for the effort and the joy and the change and the world that I may experience.